Thanks for letting me on, man. God bless you. And, and for what you're you. doing, this is the uh, most important time in history. So we need more soldiers like you, young man. And man, I, I really, you, I'm telling you, these words of encouragement from you and other brothers and sisters in Christ, it really, it, it holds me up, man. So thank you so much, brother. I really appreciate hey. it. Amen. Verily, verily. Since you, you want the verses, sir, I mean, this is one I never hear mentioned, but just look up John 14, 15, mm. and it's going to be very clear. This is a one-way direction. The Bible only points to one truth, mm -hmm. and I can just say it for you. You probably already know what it is, but sure. Jesus tells us, mm -hmm. if you love me, keep my commandments. That's right. Well, wait a minute. Whose commandments? His commandments. Uh oh, well, only uh, Elohim can own the commandments. That's right, brother. You're preaching up here, man. Uh -oh, Come on. So I'm sorry. There's only one truth, one way, one life, and nobody gets to the Father except through Him. If yeah. He owns the commandments, He is the creator of the heavens and the earth and the seas and all that in them is. It's that simple. <laughs> Every single time we try to show these people, listen, there's only one truth. Listen, this is so yeah. easy. And I love the fact that our El Shaddai has given us this information. If you don't know Jesus or Yeshua is Elohim, then you're a polytheist. If Jesus isn't God, then you're worshiping two deities. That's, That's called right. polytheism. Exactly. One plus one isn't one anymore, family. There shouldn't <laughs> be this confusion. This is the easiest math equation in history. If Amen. Jesus isn't God, you are a polytheist. It's that yep. simple. And yep. I'm sorry that people can't do math. And we are in the, we are literally in revelation. That's what apocalypse means, uh, sir. And right. it is being revealed before my eyes. I mean, I, when I asked God for the truth, I had no idea he was really going to give it to me. And if you ask Elohim for that truth, you better be ready to accept that truth. It is so powerful. It is going to change your life forever. You're not going to need any other book. There right. is no Quran. There is no pseudepigrapha. And some of the apocrypha, apocrypha might be fun, but it's not gospel. And it doesn't show us what's really important. But we are in the great deception. And I just want to bring up uh, one you know, quick thing that I, and I don't want to take up too much of your time. And I, I definitely don't want to steal your thunder. Um, but uh, <laughs> Mr. Kyrie Irving, you know, has been in the, uh, the limelight for some time yeah. in the past seven years. And I'll tell you what, Kyrie Irving is onto something. They won't let this man grow up. And he obviously has people around him that are obviously confusing him as well. Yeah, he course. is a young man that needs guidance. I mean, for instance, the name yod heh vav -Heh, I'm not going to even try to pronounce it because people don't know how to pronounce these things. Mm -hmm. But the name uh, Yahweh or Yahweh isn't necessarily the actual name of God. It's a four-letter acronym, the yod heh vav -Heh. That's So if somebody says, my name is Yahweh, that isn't going to make any sense because it's a four-letter acronym. It's actually a sentence which reads, I am the one who always is, always was, and always will be. What did Jesus say? I am the Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end, and the first and the last. It's the exact same meaning. There can only be one, and that is Yeshua. That's it. So Yeshua is actually more or closer to the name of God than Yahweh. Yahweh is not the proper name of God. And I even see a lot of Hebrew teachers get this mistake. They make this mistake and they don't realize that it's a four letter acronym uh, based on a sentence. It's, it's an explanation. Just like if you take the, the word Elohim and people get confused because the im is, is plural. Well, you see, God is very different than us. We cannot anthropomorphize our creator just because there's only one xo and only one god logic that doesn't mean we can say that god can't be at two places at the same time yes i can only be at one place at the same time i cannot be my own son but guess what elohim can do these things that we cannot understand Wait, are, you, are you are you are you like so it sounds like you uh you believe that jesus is the father well, it's hard to call Jesus the Father because he separated himself. You see, the Father was not slain, right, on the cross. The perfect sacrifice was slain. Only God can be the perfect sacrifice. So Jesus yeah, yeah. in the and flesh oh, is God so. or Elohim. We're dealing with a modalist right here. You're That's what it, it, it sounded like. There's are only you, one God. A, yeah, no, okay. yeah, obviously, yeah, because we leave five, five million gods. You're giving this guy a platform. I'm about to go live. To preach his heresy. Oh, listen, his princess, pastor. I don't need your critiquing. There's uh, only one God. His name is Jesus. You don't need to insult me. No, I'm sorry. There's only one God. He is Yeshua Hamashiach. Well, you're interrupting me. That's 
No, oh, because hey, you're, brother, brother, you're, you're a son of the brother, devil. You preach a false man. god. You're a modalist heretic. That's what you so, are. Yeah. You're, okay, you're so you don't believe Jesus god. is God. Okay. No, see, this is what you got to be, brother. My advice to you: you just gave mm -hmm. this dog a platform to bark his blasphemy. He's a modalist heretic. Really, modal? I don't know what that term means. I'm talking yeah, about the better sheep to the revelation. What are you talking about? Okay. Let me ask. Let me ask because I got to go live. Okay. Now the person. Who became Jesus? That person was he there before creation with the Father? With the Father before creation? Yes, he created all things. In the beginning was the yeah. Word, and the Word is with God, hear, and hear the Word question. was God. You didn't yes. hear my question. See, no, hear my question. The right. same was in the beginning with God. All He's, things were made by Him. All you want, Satan, your father does it too. Listen yeah. to my question. All things were made Here's by my, Him. Yes, listen He created to, all things. Listen to my listen question. To the, listen to the question. The person who became the man Jesus. That person before he became man. Was he there with another person called the Father before creation? So there were two persons before creation? No. See? Jesus is God. He so created all the things. There's only one God, right. Elohim. Do you know what the word I'm Elohim like, yeah, means? Because I got to go live. That's right. You yeah, the, the word right. Elohim is him God. It's even Jesus, the Father, pretend. and the Son. And He's so. also Jesus the guardian of the gates XO. of Israel. XO. He has many XO. names. XO. There's only one XO. God. XO, XO, XO. Yeah, you so gave you're Yeah. So, so you're saying you believe that? Uh, yeah, I got. I'm three minutes late. This is why I send this dog to come bark on my channel, not act up here. So we'll see. How I do this in real life. So no, no, yeah, yeah Jesus. Oh. Is so Sam, Sam's inviting you. Sam's inviting yeah. you to come. Yeah. That's fine. Put a, like, put a link in here. Yeah, Jesus. Your father, is the devil does it. Come, come, so yeah. Jesus has so, so, got. So I have a lot of miracles. Yeah, come on. I got Sam, miracles start, to show. Yeah, start, start the stream. Okay. He's gonna. So he's gonna start the stream. He'll send me. Uh, I'm gonna text him right now to send me the link, and then you guys can have that discussion. Um, but yeah, when you were, uh, when you, when you were talking, like I started, I was hearing like, uh, I don't know if you know what mod modalism is, but the teachings of, of modalism. Oh, there's the, there's a the link right there, right here. So there's, I, there's uh, sir, I don't know what that means. I just read the word of God in Hebrew and Greek. I study Hebrew. So, so, so modalism is this is the concept where, um, where, where, where God basically takes on different modes at certain times. So like. He was the father who then took on the mode of the son who then took on the mode of the Holy Spirit like that. Like there's there's not three distinct persons that are co-equal and one in essence, but it's one person who is God and he just takes on these different manifestations, basically. Right. Well, Mr. Logic, you, you know, this is that we cannot understand Elohim. If I could understand Elohim and put him in my pocket, he wouldn't be God. He is beyond our understanding, but only mm -hmm. God could be the perfect sacrifice. That's why I know Jesus is God. Am I going to put a man-made term on him? No, I'm going to just go with what the Bible says, like Isaiah 9, right. 6, Isaiah 43, 11. The Old Testament confirms that only Elohim can be the savior. Am I going to no, try no, to no. Uh, elaborate? No. no. Go ahead. No, no. So what, I, what I'm saying is like, and, and which is you're 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 right to an extent that you know we, we can't fully understand God in His essence. We only know what He reveals to us, right? We only know what He reveals to us through His Scripture. And so, what we're uh, what we're addressing is this is this idea that God just it just takes on manifestations. That there's not three distinct persons that have always coexisted with each other as the one God that teach to go against that teaching is is not scriptural so i think that's what sam was trying to get at with you um like just hearing what you're you know how you're talking about what your faith and how you understood the scriptures he was he was going to try to like just bring bring some understanding like now nah, because the scripture is clear that jesus um the word and the father existed together before creation two distinct amen. persons right and so you said amen. amen, but you said amen. But when he asked you this, you you didn't believe that there were two there are two persons, right, who are completely united in essence that existed before creation, the Word and the Father, right. And then if you the third one is the Spirit, the Spirit of God, the Holy Spirit. Correct. Yes. Right. So these so the belief the Scriptures teach that these three persons, the the Father, the Word, and the Spirit, existed together from eternity's past, co-eternal in communion and fellowship with each other as the one God, as the one divine essence. That is correct. Yes. Th that's the only way it would make sense. 
Okay. There's one. Okay. There's one from the beginning. That's why he's the Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end, the first and the last. Yeah. So there's no other option. The the Holy Spirit is something again, I can't understand the Holy Spirit, right? But obviously yeah. that is God. That's the essence of God. That's the ruach, right? The the breath, the life. Yeah. You know, that's him. So like it's it's interesting. Like, so you like you're you affirm you're affirming these these things. Well, at the same time, like earlier, it sounded like um, like it was just a little off. That's why I like it. So when we say like, for example, <clears throat> Jesus, Jesus, the word is not the father. The word is not the father. You affirm that? Yes, because that's why it says, well, it says in the beginning was the word and the word was with God and the word was God. Do I understand okay. that? No, but I believe it. OK. All right. Amen, brother. So. Uh, uh, Sam's getting ready to send me the stream link, and hopefully you guys can have a a good conversation over there with. <laughs> well, Mr. God Logic, I'll just end it with this: then that that yeah. we are under the great deception. <laughs> there is no such thing as outer space. It is the number one satanic religion in the world that has deceived outer millions space. of people. There outer is no space. such. Do you understand what I'm saying? <laughs> no. Outer okay, there's no, there's no okay. All these space, do you see that these things they put on TV? They always put phallic symbols and they pretend to send them to outer space and they show you cartoons on TV. This is what Kyrie Irving was talking about seven years ago, and he used a different term uh, that I'm not going to use because it's not accurate. You see, both uh, sides are wrong. Else. Else. There's he only else. one truth, and Jesus has it. We don't live in a geocentric creation, we live in a Jesus centric creation. You see what I'm getting at? Well, I agree that Jesus is the only truth. Um, okay. I'm, I can't go and, and deny. Do you, do you think that we live on an object in outer? Do you think the Earth is an object of a measurement that man yeah. can tell you the size of Earth? Uh, I I know we live on a planet. We well, a, well, a planet means a wandering star. So do you think we live on a star? I don't think we live on a star. I think we live on a planet. A planet is not necessarily a wandering star. Well, do you think the Earth is stationary, or do you think the Earth is moving? I think if the Earth moves in a solar system, I think it. Oh rotates. my goodness, God, logic! It says that's, the foundations that's, that's, of the that's, Earth shall never that's, be moved. That's, a, that's another thing, man. That's another. Right. Thing. Well, it's right. Okay. What is what is King David? Hold on, hold on. King, uh, King David, Psalm twenty-four. Go ahead. The XL. The XL. So go. I, um, they posted the link of of uh, of Sam Stream because he wants to talk to you about like the idea of of, of God and the concept of God. So I go better ahead, go brother. on. Yeah. <laughs> so make sure make sure you're respectful though. Make sure you're respectful and keep it cool. If you're cool, he'll be cool, and you guys can have a beautiful conversation. Maybe people can learn from the conversation. All right, okay? well, young man, I appreciate your patience for me, and I, I understand that I am a little bit difficult to deal with. But I'll tell you what: <laughs> every word in the Bible is true. When yeah. God says the foundations of the earth shall never be moved, that means the earth is not moving. I used to work for the government. And that's why I know these things. They lie about everything. If they told no you problem. that re no we revolve around the sun, they lie. We don't revolve no around the sun. It no says problem. in Psalms 19 but that the sun is on going, a tabernacle. You're going off again. You're going off again. You're going, I, you're I'm going probably guilty again. of that. Yeah. You want me to stop? <laughs> yes. Yes. Can I read one verse? Man, Can you did it already. One? Just go. Oh, well, get out Psalm out. 24. Don't be scared of this, young man. Oh, Listen, it's, it's Psalm 24. King David, are you scared of it? XO, XO. I'm, I'm, you, I'm I can't you, read it for the people. I'm letting you know right now. I'm letting you know right now, brother, that this is going out, outward, beyond the purpose of my stream. So if you can respect that, that's why I had you on this long. All right. I'm very I'll patient. respect it. Thank you. I appreciate it. All right, sir. All right. Well, God bless you guys. Just God remember the you. word God of God is quick and powerful. Amen. God bless. Amen. Amen. I'm going to try to get that link now. All peace right. out. Peace, peace. Satan, your father. So why don't you come on? See, we got, see this dog right here? Let's see how well you're going to do defending your motives in scripture. Okay, John, little whore, Barton, you are the heirs of Satan, your father. So come on. Okay. Come on, son of Satan. Let's see. If you can control your passions and not preach and bark like you did in the other channel, then maybe we can get a discussion and I will destroy your fake God. So there he goes. Now this guy likes to bark and preach. Let's see how well he does. So are you there, princess? Hey, what's going on, buddy? How you doing? Yeah, good. Hopefully you can control yourself, little princess, because you call me princess, and I'm going to make you my little girl. Sure thing. Go ahead. All right. Now, so people know why you're a heretic. You're not the heir of the fathers. You're the heir of Satan. Who was Jesus when he was on earth in relationship to the father? Jesus on earth, who was he in relationship to the father? He's the son of God, the Mashiach. What does that mean, he's the son of God? That means he's the only savior. He is the only truth, the light, the word. That's not what I asked you. In relationship to the Father, if he is a man on earth, who is he in relationship to the Father? 
the son. Can I, do you want me a different answer? No, I want you to be clear. Not like your father, the devil, who likes to be. Uh -huh. I know. So I know. is Jesus the father on earth? No, there's only one father. He is in heaven. Okay, so Jesus is not the father. The father is in heaven. Jesus is on earth. But you just said you're a modalist. No, I'm not a modalist. I'm sorry that you're trying no. to anthropomorphize Elohim. You can't no, understand no. God. Don't use terms you don't know what no, they mean. Listen, what your puny little brain can't understand Yeshua. I'm sorry. Stop barking. What does anthropomorphize mean? Define it means that to term. make like men. It means to compare okay. to humans. How does, how does making Jesus the Father make him like a man? Yeah, you're trying to put your own understanding. Yeah, you're comparing him to no, God. No, I didn't. I asked you questions. See, you're being stupid. I didn't even tell you what I believe. I'm asking you what you believe. You're See? just, bro, listen, you do what everybody, you just want to seem smart, and that's fine. I'm okay. sure you're a smart oh, man. I said Jesus is God, and you're trying. Are you going to start barking? Stop barking and preaching. And John Barton, you little son of the devil, you slut. Come on, or we're going to muzzle you. You got my link. Send John Barton out of here. Stop barking and preaching. You're not here to preach. You're here to defend your position. So I defend you, Jesus. No, you defend Lucifer, who you think is. Well, Jesus. my channel has mirrors. Can you shut up and stop barking, you st stupid son of the devil? Your father, the devil, does miracles too. Second Thessalonians chapter 2, verses 9 to 12, Revelation 13. And in Matthew 24, 23 to 25, Jesus said, False prophets, false Christ will do signs and wonders. So all you prove is that you're full of Satan. Your father's the devil, and he's empowering you. Can you now shut up and tell us what you believe? Now let's try it again. So when Jesus is on earth, Jesus is on earth. Is he God in the flesh, or is he just a man? No, he is El Shaddai in the flesh. Okay, you see how this dumb Jew wannabe, this stupid bastard, keeps talking Hebrew as if he knows Hebrew, and he's not even an Israelite? Okay, so are you ethnically a Jew? Man, you're angry. No, I'm no, Israelite. Satan, your father. That's that's uh, well. I guess that's why I'm a preacher, and you're not. So okay, you're now, just gonna keep hating. Shut up! Stop barking, little dog. You see, you're gonna keep barking like a little demon, and I'm gonna muzzle you, you stupid, dumb, satanic bastard. So let's try it again before I block you. One more time, you dumb dog. You poor what? little boy. Would you? Would you? Look at your little bald head. I'll rub it. I'm sorry, Jesus is God, and you can't touch it. Okay, what are you so gonna do? Is he the Jesus father? is God. What's the point? There can only. Okay. You are a dumb, stupid bastard. Go back to your vomit, you little spiritual whore. You see? Now bring John Barton. See? Ah, I'm angry. You're the one barking like a little dumb spiritual bastard whore. <laughs>